my name's Malcolm Udy. I'm managing director of uh, the Udy Group and group of companies. My two boys and my daughter are directors as well in the company. We're a private enterprise. We um, are constantly looking for new innovative ideas with anything new like solar and there's not a lot of it in New Zealand. I quite like the idea of the innovative using um, solar energy, you know, not having to burn fossil fuels and all that. So I've always been interested in it. With the property up north and the cost of power up there, when they came back with the numbers, it actually was easy. Like the, it, it actually just, you know, if they could produce the numbers they said, it wasn't a hard decision to fund it. It was an easy decision. Our motivation for looking at solar initially was uh, rising power costs um, and how we can create a sustainable business platform for ourselves and for our tenants. With owning buildings, you know, we're constantly looking for new ideas on how we can keep our tenants happy, keep up with the modern modern ways. And the my two boys, John and Dan, they came up with the, the idea that solar might work for us. Our mission to, to look into solar really came from increased co we're, we're always striving to decrease our running overhead for our customers, for our tenants. Um, every year we seem to struggle with rising costs, whether it be rates, power, insurances. So I guess this is just a way for us just to take a bit of control back and creating a sustainable business model for ourselves and for our tenants. Originally back in 03, I think we built the centre, our, our biggest power bill per month was about $4,000. And we're getting upwards of $13,000 a month for the summer peaks uh, for air conditioning. And that's a big overhead for our tenants to carry. And we're hoping to hedge that for them moving forward. So our system will it'll offset between 70 and 80% of the total power bill. So our energy cost will be locked in. I guess our motivation for solar is a little bit different. Like we're not greenies as such. Um, we're not centre wearing hippies. Like obviously we're, we're, we're business people. So our motivation was not really the green aspect of it. It was the return on investment aspect of it. The process with um, choosing PowerSmart, we gave everybody a, a clean sheet of paper um, to start with. We thought, let's go out to the market, let's test who's worth the grain of salt and who's, who's good and who's not. And um, we were really surprised. Um, the guys came back, they were very commercial, they've done this before, it's nothing out of their, it was not out of their scope. So in a commercial sense, these guys were, were leaps and bounds ahead of everybody else. Our advice for a commercial, another commercial company or a commercial application going forward, um, like I, I think solar is the future. I think um, I think eventually, like it'll become implemented in, in terms of the building and its initial build, and, and actually, instead of being an add-on, it'll be actually from from when the plans are drawn, it'll be implemented, um, be part of the building system. I think it's it's really come leaps and bounds. Um, and has it's come a, a viable option now. Dealing with PowerSmart, we were talking about this the other day that we've never had a project go so smoothly. I mean, we've finished about two weeks before they were scheduled to finish, and everybody that was involved, it was nice to have their excitement for, for being on the job and being part of the New Zealand's mm -hmm. largest one. That sort of made us feel good as well. From what I've seen of the whole process with dealing with PowerSmart, it's just been easy. The guys have put the, the right numbers forward all the way through. The work's been done to a really good standard and ahead of time and I'm just really pleased with the whole thing.